Hello guys, welcome back to some more Country Kid Gaming. It's playing some more Shout Out to Earth Tree. See, we're back on the Mace playthrough. And I decided, you know what? There's no point for me to do, like, worry about the quests and stuff like that on this character. It's just a mage run. That's what my uh, New Game Plus character is for. So, we're just going to collect the magic and fight the bosses. <laughs> That's the only really goal I have for this playthrough now. I make more of those. I don't really care for them. Let's end. Let's place those with these. Now, I remember, lastly, correctly, we should have done both of these, right? Because I've already gotten this. Yeah. And then, yeah, this is the first time I've been here, so that means I already did that coffin. So I know all the items on the map. Okay. And instead of going to the Black Keep to get those spells, we're actually going to go get the spells. Um, we're going to go get the Progressing Knight. We're going to kill him, and then there's another spell down here as well. That's one of the same. It's a, not, not the same spell, but it's a Processant. Processant or Progressant? It's one of those. I'm bad at it. It names. We're gonna go ahead and go that way. Kind of make things a little bit different and then my main character makes sure we're doing it in different orders so that way the episodes aren't the same locations when they upload it. So this is my mage run is gonna be shorter than my new game plus. My new game plus is when I'm you know my character where I'm collecting everything. So just gonna go ahead and draw these. my level here this lesson level 10 okay I need to hurry up get some more so I can I think I need what two or three yeah so we're gonna go here and get the two spells down here and then I'm gonna see what other spells that I can get outside uh, they keep and go ahead and grab those no we did get some fingerprint spells now we did get these I know there's basically two more you can get on your mirrors quest and actually killing the, the mother of fingers other than me being able to do Ymir's quest, she doesn't actually give any spells. She just gives a gazing fingerprint and her staff, which I don't need, but that's for both faith and intelligence. So, I think the hardest boss we're probably going to have is going to be the last boss, simply just because of how aggressive he is. The rest of them are aggressive too, but magic is pretty strong. And I'm pretty much steamrolling people in New Game Plus. <laughs> now that... I didn't beat the game without using summons and spirits and stuff, so now using them, pretty much like taking candy for a baby. So, if you wanted to see my run without using them, except for uh, the couple NPC ones doing their quest lines, then you would need to watch my first playthrough. Now, like I said before, how you play the game is how you play the game. You know, you don't have to play it like I did. But I think a lot of people do that on their first run, try to beat it by themselves, and then on the second run, do whatever they want. Some people, they're just going to use spirits and everything for me to get them, because they're in the game, they're for you to use. Like, the game is definitely meant for that. You can definitely tell even more now, because they got the reverted spirit as plus. It just makes sense, you know, they wouldn't have that blessing there if they didn't want you to use spirits. So. People must be getting invaded. I'm surprised people die from that. It's not that difficult of a trek down compared to a lot of the other ones in the game. This is a kind of a big dungeon, though, for them to be able to not use Torn inside. But I get, you know, can't use Torn inside dungeons, but this is such an open space you would think. But it's all good. No, 
I'm still heavy loading to get my endurance back up to be able to go back and around for me. Is there something up in our place? Bar go down. Yeah, there's an item both ways. I can go back that way. I ain't gonna never use this material, but a lot of times if I see something, I'll pick it up. Just to distract people, and I don't really need that. So, I may go back using the sorcery sword until I can get my lady uh because of the stat I'm using it as because I'm I'm trying to use the royal magic grease. Well I guess eventually I'll change it to frost and I won't have to worry about it but when I run into royal magic grease. Because it's not as strong. Because I don't have the stats for any of the infusions that you can still buff weapons. I'm good. It's all good though. I don't have no rune arcs on this character. So I'm not really losing anything when I die. Should be able to get them wings back. But I was just thinking about it. there's no point for me to try to collect everything with this character. Since it's really just a character I have. Just because I wanted to have played the game again, and then when I heard about the DLC, I was like, oh yeah, I can make this character with the DLC as well. So that way I can just play it again. Is it right here? That last attack should have missed me, but it's all good.
They don't know how to keep their breath to themselves. Trying to put me to sleep with that. Here I've been in my love. How you gonna bend in your love, but <laughs> rain in the rain full of peace, love, and serenity. That's this whole thing, make this whole thing, so how do you abandon love and think that you can do that? Nah, I think this spell is this way. That doesn't make sense. At all. Okay, no, it's Probably gonna end up changing my stats for the last boss, though. If I can't defeat him, how I think I can. My strategy doesn't end up working. It actually doesn't use that much uh, FP when I think about it. It only uses FP at the beginning of the attack. I don't know why I thought the Velvet Sword of St. Trina was something you had to get from a quest line. I don't know why I thought that I'm a other character because I kept saying I'm probably going to miss out of the, on that sword, but no. You don't miss out on that sword. Never mind, the spell is farther down. I remember that. Yeah, the spell is farther down. I don't know why I thought, you know, I'm gonna miss out on that second sword. No, you just get it from playing it. Okay, so I can't get two of them. Anymore. I don't know why I thought it was part of his quest. Line. It may be that uh, I don't need that talisman again, and I don't need the headpiece again, so it doesn't matter then. Okay, so I didn't really mess up my chances. That spell is a little too slow. I think this one's gonna be better. I got stuck on a rock. That was fake. See how fast it stood up? He kill you first and come back.
one of the most annoying. I don't know why they decided to do that. They're okay when they just explode, but who decided that? <laughs> it was like, you know what, let's make them shoot laser beams at That would be so challenging. I just want to know who decided that. <laughs> who thought that was a good idea? Uh, no, no, we can just keep doing. I do pretty good to do some damage. Spells coming up. This way. There it goes. Mass of Petrescence. Skeleton. Can I craft those yet, or have I not found that clip? Book? Seven Smith Stones, eight. Thirty one thirds. I 
matter if you dodge, buddy. They come back for you. Last time I just murked him. This time he murked me. It really was because I missed that shot when he jumped in the air. I just need to nuke him. That's all it is. How do y'all be hit, hurting me just by touching me, man? Not even hit me with your weapon. I really do need to fix that crap. I don't care if that's intentional. That's just weird. I'm trying to do my Ash of War, not a spell. Oof. I wonder why he's the only shiny that gives me something special, because the other ones don't. Well, I'll put it on later. Like find your skeletons if you drop anything good. Looks like I missed something. I can see an item on a body. Uh, can I come back? Um, I think I can come back. Nice job. But it definitely looks like I missed something. I need you to give me nectar blood. Switch out rare drop is. It doesn't look like any of you drop one. Huh? Yeah, but this is where you would farm nectar blood from if you need it. Yeah, if you ran out of the ones that you can pick up. Pretty sure they didn't patch it either. I hope not. <laughs> I hope it was intentional.
See if I can just get one to drop real quick. Usually I would just use the wave of gold, but I don't think I can use that. Anymore. That was a rare drop, but I hope they didn't patch it and take it out. She should show up as a magic drop, so I don't even gotta pick all this up. She just show up as purple. These are white. a couple more times and then we'll just go in go back and look for that item got it a lot easier before maybe they made it harder to get but even again this character only has nine our gains so usually once you get over like 300 pretty much have better chances well then again it's all really just based on Probability is not really guaranteed, even with higher things. There's some people that get lucky with stuff. And, well, I don't believe in luck. There's some people that get blessed with uh, getting it faster than others. All oh, those are white. I really hope they didn't patch it out. Cause that would suck. I don't think they would though, cause they didn't patch out Bliss Bones from They dropped from Mesmer soldiers, mostly Fire Knights, but they also dropped from the uh the actual Mesmer soldier, not the common one. So I don't think that they would get rid of this. There it goes, man. Okay, so they still drop. Today is the 8th of July, so as of 8th of July is not patched. It still drops. I forgot some of these do drop foul foot, so I might want to pick those up in the summer and then. So yeah, what I usually do is just do use the wave of gold though. 
can just use that to do it. Get some more. This is faith. No, I can use the spell. Oh, I might use it before, just in case you haven't seen it. It hits for the damage and then explodes. So, it's like presence ghost flame, basically. I don't know how effective it'll be against a boss that has the same, <laughs> made of the same stuff though. Ooh, almost died. Okay, so there was an item on this back there. I don't know how to get to this. We may have to go back the other way to get to it. Um, may have to drop back down here. There was a guy. Corpse. Oh, it's right there. Yeah. That's where those guys are in. I don't think it's an important item, but I don't believe we can get it. Guys are just annoying. They got ridiculous stagger too. I mean, boys. Yeah, not cool. Felt it in my bones. They're so annoying. I probably won't even go back for that hundred thousand. I'm gonna be honest with you. <laughs> I'm probably not gonna go back for that. Do I have rooms? I'm not gonna go back for it. I'm just being honest with you. Those guys are so annoying to me. I don't like having the rooms things because you can't get rid of the compass. It's not part of your hood, technically. It won't go away. Like, you can't hide it, so. I think it may go away during bosses sometimes, but that's about it. Alright. Last time I could've gotten my first try. See if I can do the same. I don't think I'll be able to get that off. So start with a rainy dark moon. I think this guy comes out to brown, right? No, he comes out where St. Trina is. As soon as I got hit. I just did it too early. I should have waited till after he did his moveset. I didn't know he was going to do the moveset where he runs around like three or four times. I haven't really fought this guy that much because I beat him on my first try. So, And then I've only been summoned here a couple times doing multiplayer. It's just really erratic. I'm not a hard boss. You gotta be patient. And if you attack right here, you'll lose all your stamina when you land, so be careful of doing that. I try to do that to land on top of them whenever <laughs> we do a multiplayer, but it never really works. I get close, 
It's almost hitting him, but it's not smart. Keep forgetting my health is lower because uh, I got on that talisman. May take it off. Worse and worse. That's what really kills me. It's not him, it's the force. Far is that it's head. That's what I want to know. I would have survived if I didn't get frostbitten right there too. I've seen it. But I don't think I need this no more because I'm not using that special staff. Yeah. Oh, I'm playing as a mage. I don't need that one. Oh, I don't have the plus three one yet. Um do generation and we'll take this fake off I I'll change my class to fix it later I should have plenty of lava tears still on this character right yeah, six and one I still got eight more to find in the DLC so I should be good uh, we're gonna go with this She's supposed to go the other way. Frostbite right there too, so I don't need to use that anymore. Very clever, buddy. That combo he just did was very clever. No, I don't have any. It's not Frostbite. Okay, so that spell's not going to be good for him because how fast he moves. Alright. And Tisha's not going to be good because how fast he moves and the fact that he's so erratic. I think the mimic is going to be the way to go. It goes out. Mm, just because of how this boss is. 
Let's just boost our defense. Too hard of a boss. Let's put that on. I wonder. It'll be hard. It's really because I have this hood so on. Probably need to just say forget it. Actually, it's got better the elemental defense, so it'll be fine. Up so I can use this spell. I'll probably just wait until I actually can use it. And I actually have the concoction on this one, right? Yeah, I have four of them. And this is the rolling branch. That's what I need at the generation. Yes, sir. Exit. No, 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 I'll leave it there because I end up using it a lot if I don't. Let's. I'll just go, since I'm here, I'll go ahead and do this. Now, how strong is this sword if I level it up? I may swap the Milady out just for this one. Since it's yeah. I may have to change my stats around for it, but it's alright if I do. I had something I'm heading south. I've recalled he just go. That must be where. I'll buy one more. Just for a sec. Mm -hmm. Do we have anything on me? Um, just can. I'm heading south of the shore. This is right here. But I'm not gonna go out of my way to do anybody's quest anymore.
Especially since this is just my maze playthrough. So this is E, E, and D. I need to see how much longer. Okay, so he's down here. Okay, we'll ignore him. I need to see after I leveled up what the actual thing is. Also, get rid of some of this extra crap I got. Still D D and D strength intelligent and dex. See what this is. Some magic build. We're gonna barricade shield. This one. This one. We haven't got the other one yet. Ways of darkness for now. So. I'll keep it. I'll sell this. You can get a bunch of those. Um, I've used this weapon. It's okay, but I don't consider it to be worth my main. I don't have the rest of them yet, so I'll keep it. So I'm gonna change my stats around a little bit. Lightning is negative. <laughs> we got my blessing. Spell. Weapon. This to this. Uh, actually, no, I like the regular one instead of that one. Oh, this seems to. Um, I guess we'll get rid of that. For now. Okay, so no, we'll get rid of the regular one. Then... We got the rings for frostbite, so I guess we'll put that back. Okay, and to use this spell, we need what? Twenty-two and twenty-six. change it or else it'll be a while. And so we may have to take uh, the increased memory slots. Oh, is it thy way? Now. I'm not gonna lie, this health is kind of... We do need this 60. <laughs> the endurance... Maybe at 30. And then we need 72 intelligence to be able to use the moments. 26 strength. So I'm still gonna need. More of these, even it out. Ah, my thanks. 
My heavy load now. No, I'm still not done. Okay. D, D, and D. I need to keep raising my strength and dex to get the most out of this weapon. So I'm just going to have to raise strength and dex evenly as I go on. No, obviously I can't use my lady anymore. Six for six. I'm just going to have to raise strength and dex. Thirty-four. Dang, so this one's actually better. So this one boosts the full moon sorceries. Three seventy-three. I know this one's way better. Three twenty-six. Hmm. Three thirty-four. It's not that big of a difference. So. At the same time. Considering the fact that I only have one full moon. I don't know why it says the sorcery scale in this. Oh no, it's 334. I don't know why I looked at the wrong. I thought it said 340. Okay. No, I'm still good though. Better way. This one because this procs frostbite. Okay, it's not as good as that one. This proc frostbite. Is. Take the moon, the night. So, I really want the gun blade. Not really. I don't really need a magic missile right now. I'll take this one because it's good for tracking. Fingerprint one's good too, but that one's a little bit better for tracking. Okay. Everybody's already moved because I broke the thing. Like I said, I'm not really worried about the quest too much, but if I run into one, I'll do them. I will follow the half is the black key. Okay, we know where you go. Okay. I got this spell. Let's check it out. Let's go. Some enemies. See how strong this is. And now, okay, so this is 797. Probably get close to a thousand once I get the rest of the, the blessings. this week but for some more okay okay the hit miss but explosion does way more damage okay let's try this one Okay, so this is more of a lot of enemies are around, and it's pretty fast, I'm not gonna lie. It's almost an instant cast, especially with this talisman on. Vortex of Press... Presses... Oh, hold on, let me, let me pop back up. I hate P-words, like, they're like the worst thing for me for pronunciation. <laughs> Processions. Processence, right? Processence. Processence. Yeah, this is definitely more for not single target, unless the target is big. It's, you can't even charge it, so. 
Zappy to keep enemies from around you. This one is for a close single target. So where is next for magic? Got a pretty good new ones. Does it? Still like four or five new ones looks good. Is it time to go to the Black Keep? Let me check it out. To what the next location for magic is? Because you get spell in there for beating Glavius or whatever his name is. So you know. And then. I know it's incantations, but we're only looking at sources right now. Uh, impenetrable thorns, that's also inside the Black Keep. Mana of Thorns is also in the Black Keep. And the rest of them is for finish the quest line, which is so basically the Black Keep. So, yeah, we just need to go to Black Keep for everything. For Blaze of Stone and Gravitational Missiles, because that's in the Hinterlands. So the Black Keep is our next get, basically to get the rest of the magic that there is. Uh, and we already got the Church District one. So, <laughs> let's go ahead and knock this out. I don't know if we're fighting Mesmer this episode, though. Okay. Let's do. Basically, let's get rid of these. I'm gonna try using this. We'll see just how good it is. It's probably not gonna be that good. That one on. These are all from the DLC, and then this one. We'll replace this one with another one. We are gonna have to use the memory slot thing, though. Because two of these use two slots. I'll probably end up getting rid of the vanishing though. And then probably need to replace one. Because it's alright, but it's kind of slow to cast. This hood, though. Does that put me heavy low? I think this, yeah, that puts me heavy low. I don't know if he can knock you down off of these or what. So, that doesn't put me heavy load. I'll, I'll stick with this just in case. And I'm getting something else and it'll be having a heavy load later. This is all just until we get the fingerprint stuff. And we'll put that on. And we'll probably replace. It depends on if this staff is not as good as the fingerprint staff. Even with that on there. And as buff. If it is, then I'll just keep using this staff. But if not, we're going to switch to the fingerprint staff. 
I think it'll end up being stronger, but I've never really had a... I pretty much end up using not the maternal staff, which is the finger staff. The... Jesus. I pretty much use the other staff that you get from the mother fingers that... Because my other character, I have the stats to be able to split in faith. But I'm thinking that the maternal staff is going to be the way to go. Once we have your mirror's outfit and stuff. We'll see if that's still the case. This is a dedicated build. Uh, on my new game plus character, I really never had a dedicated build. Um, well, I've never tried. I haven't tried magic in new game plus yet. I pretty much have just been sticking to different weapons and stuff. But I'm pretty sure it'll still be OP because my other character is almost at level 300. So but we'll see. If not, we'll stick with this mat. I think this was just a uh, um, carrying rig. Yeah, we'll stick with this one. But I think the maternal staff plus your mirror's coat is gonna be the strongest combination. Because fingerprint spells are, are disgusting. And it's quite a lot. It's more than just these two. There's two more. So I won't say a lot, but it's a good amount. Jesus. Almost died playing around with her. Don't need this one no more. worried about the summon spirits right now using the iris or oculation so we can ignore Quileg for now I guess it gotta land on the ground for it to blow explode. Dang, how did that even miss? Jesus, yeah. It seems like it's gotta land on the ground for it to explode. It's mainly because of that double spell. Yeah, the mass is just a little too slow, even with this. And I can't double stack this. I could use that other staff, but it's it would maybe use more FP to cast faster. I don't want to do that. I noticed another reason why I'm taking damage is because I have this staff. There's a talisman on. So, we'll see. I may just take it off because it may not be worth the damage I'm taking. Especially since my lesson is still only halfway there. I think last time I did this, my blessing was like at 14, 15. I 
need to get a side of grace first before I really jump. using the thorn spell that puts on the thorns on your body the mental thorns because it's not really that good and to my opinion you know some people may feel differently but the damage is pretty negligible I don't think it caused bleed either so think about it probably will take the extra defense the extra defense can I do that? Let me have a load. Spells, but oh, yeah. figured at least hit one of y'all. If I want to put that on, oh, I don't got the stats for it. Almost got it though. They make that my main weapon, but it's not. I have a first and shield with the spells. Maybe a pretty nasty. I have to wait till my um, strength gets there though. I don't remember what the scaling on strength is. I'll have to wait and see. How did he get off that last spell when he was dead? That that I don't want to see. What?
frostbite him with the ghost mine? Man, the guy, so is this the scabbard tree? I think this one may be the scabbard tree. We don't need to do that yet. That's how you get an incantation, we don't need that. May want to get this out of first, though. Nah, because it's going to take me down there a little bit. We'll wait for that. We only need to do that before the last boss so that way we can have the charm breaker. Make those great room. I need to remember how to get the guys. I think you've got to go to the store room. You know what they're called? Yeah, storehouse. I wonder how good this is versus big targets. Pretty good. I don't think that'll be useful, man. It doesn't really do too much uh, damage when you roll into people. Unless they, they change the scale another or something. No, they don't do bleed, so I can kind of understand if, like, if they did bleed damage. I just don't think it'll be useful. I think the other Thorn one is very useful. It does insane damage. And I have tried it before, but it seems like when you used to wear Kirk's armor, that's what it seems like. Or when the Ring of... Uh, I think the Ring of Thorns actually was better in Dark Souls 2. Like the Ring of Thorns plus 2. Get more damage. And I don't think they count as counter damage, so I can't put the spear ring on and make it do more damage when I roll, you know? Like, if it counted as counter damage, then maybe I can see that being useful. But I guess it's if if you're always rolling anyway and you put it on there and you're fighting a boss, you might be able to kill the boss by rolling. 
You know what I mean? Like at the last minute when they got a little health left and just roll into them. I think it's more useful to interrupting uh, human NPC, NPC enemies types. I don't know why I thought there was a cookbook here before. I know they have moved some of the item placements since the people who had the review copy because I, when I watched some people's videos after my first initial playthrough so I wouldn't be spoiled. Some of them got items in places that I didn't get so I know they moved some items. One of those are the thorn sorcery spell used to be somewhere different. I noticed that too and I was just like hmm. I wonder why they decided that. the frostbite first. I know Ghost Flame can cause frostbite, but I think this might do it faster than the other spell. There we go. This spell's a lot faster to cast than the mask. I think I may be able to get the mask one off here, though. Nope. It's my fault for trying to charge it. Here. It caused some frostbite real quick too. Hmm. But then again, this enemy is not that strong defense against status effects, so. See how the frostbite's already gone? So the fingerprints got less range. Oh, I knew I was dead. When I hit that wall, I knew it was over. Cocky little crab. <laughs> that wall, I knew it was gonna be over. <laughs> as soon as I touched it. But yeah, this is the end. This is the end for me. First, my YouTube uploads, so you gotta click on the video again. Wait, continue uploading. You keep forgetting, like, trying to run and jump in the water, it's, it's like you can't jump forward, you can only jump up. It's weird. Yeah, 
this spell is, it reminds me of another spell, um, the fire spell that you use that explodes. It's like, if it doesn't land on the ground, it won't explode. Or it only, like, it, it'll go through the enemy and explode too, but... Depending on the target, I don't know how I feel about it. Because missing the explosion misses most of the damage. Did I just die? Are you serious? I don't even know how many rows I just lost. <laughs> Playing around with this crab. But yeah, that's the only thing I don't like about this spell. Um, I know what I'm talking about. There's a couple of there's like three fire spells in this game, I want to say. Not incantations, but just spells. And um, one of them, it will explode if it lands. If not, it just does damage to the enemy. This is what this reminds me of. But the damage isn't as good. Because, like, wherever the spell lands is if it's going to be good or not. But it depends on the enemy. It looks like it can go straight through an enemy, which is not good. I hate spells that, unless it, it's meant to be like a piercing spell, I don't like spells that do that. Because it kind of like defeats the purpose of the spell if I'm hitting the enemy, but I don't get both the attacks. So at least I know that that spell is not going to be good for uh, the crabs, at least. Really? This is the spell I selected. I'm going too far. It'll be good for like this and then swap over. Yeah, this one's better for the uh, crabs. To get some of my runes back. Hmm. I may get the um no, that's pretty much the sort of knights of dex weapon. It's not really a magic weapon, so I'm not gonna need this. I'll get one more anyway, but this will give me my rune art, so I'll take that. I don't think there's an item back here. It's just what do we pop up? Oh, no, there is one. Okay. And plus, like I said, I'll get one more, and I'll be able to use it if I want to do the sword or knight. But it's not really a magic weapon. It's really a dex weapon. Even the shield of knight is one too, as well. Trying to think. Is there anything else down here? I don't believe so. Because to get to command of guys is through the storehouse. I just don't remember which one he is directly. You can do that. Let us sleep. Got to sleep. Dang. I wasted my run art. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that this thing was weak to sleep like that. <laughs> I was saying like, nah, fall asleep, fall asleep.
I keep forgetting how tough these knights were like when you first play them. Because this character is not, you know, it's just 177. The knights are pretty freaking hard. That's my fault though for just trying to <laughs> sleep it. Should have got the backstab, the eternal miss. That probably would have been better. If I actually used the Ash of War instead of trying to just keep hitting it. They got some high sleep resistance though because the Divine Warriors that be using the storm attacks, they fell asleep way fast. This enemy didn't even seem like he was going to fall asleep. You know, they got some sleep tolerance. Yeah, I am going to take this off. I'm going to put this bad build back on. We have more attack. This ain't my, my new game plus character where I'm just steamrolling y'all. Gotta be a little bit more careful. It's better now that I took the talisman off. It's not gonna hit the ground. I would say the mass for the bosses because you got to use it at the right place or it's not working. else was shooting me. I know it was more than one person because that guy right there. No, 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 no. That's probably gonna hit Freya. <laughs> this 
this shit. That's such a fast spell. <laughs> the one fingerprint by so. None of these guys use uh, magic, so the NPCs don't really helpful to me. There may be a couple ones you can get for helping leader that might work. The one that does the dodging, the backstab, and I think one of this. Well, I think it's rolling backsteps, and then one is after a dash attack. So those might be useful to me. Other than that, there ain't really much that's useful to me. As a mage. If I do this now, what will this take me? I can always come back to the side of grace. And make that jump. At least to nowhere. This will take me back down to the first floor. This will lead me. This there. Oops, dead. Should have put on a cat ring. the wrong jumps. Let's put on a little bit. Oh, do I not have the cat ring? Oh, I don't have the cat ring on this here. I didn't go down. It's all good. Then I just died again. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I don't know why gravity been kicking my butt lately. Like Yeah, without the cat ring, I'm not gonna make that fall. Okay. Because I can't jump straight into the building. So I will go ahead and hit the switch, because it, it's not gonna make no difference. I was thinking maybe I would be able to. But... With the switch. I could go all the way down, but. I can do that another way.
I'm gonna just kill myself. <laughs> I thought I had killed kill myself. What's it do? I still have to go back up there. Surprise I reach. I guess the other one goes farther, but it does less damage. The single glintstone nail. Okay. That's good to know. It goes farther but does less damage. The other one does more damage, but the one that was fine. Go back up later when you are. Go. 
I'm gonna ask one second, this is all. Did I get the... No, I didn't get the fire one yet. I know where it is, though. Might go run and get it real quick. If I have trouble with the boss. So fast, man, it's hard to dodge two of them. This is the way up from the black keep, I want to say. I mean, the shadow keep. If I remember correctly. And I think the other way is the way down to go to the next area. Go to the, the ruins of Rura, I want to say. Yeah, this is how I go back down the shadow keep. I'm thinking this is the way. I don't think this is Kamina Gox, but maybe it is. No, this is their way. To go for it, yeah. Gotta go back to the shadow keep for them, guys. No, 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 I don't. It's on the outs outskirts of this to go. How do you go to commander? I remember that. Right after Anba, but there was one soul. After it appears his been taken surely after failing, I'd do anything. What could the implicate? I'm not gonna give me anything. You know I'm not worried about doing your quests. So. There's no point to kill you because you don't give me anything that helps with magic, so. Yeah. 
Looks like it's only going to be good versus big targets. What? He hit me off the last one? That was so lame. So I was able to push to the first attack. But he was able to hit me before I could slam down. Or she was able to hit me. I think most of the fire knights are women. Based on the character model, that's what it looks like. Jesus, man. So much damage. Them daggers not even that good, man. <laughs> to be honest, they're not that good. Like, they do fire damage and they look cool, but that's about it. They don't have no special art to go with them. The, the two major arts, I don't think you can use it on the daggers. But maybe the one that shoots the fire spear one you may be able to. I might have to check it out. But the daggers themselves don't have no unique art. Stone tablet, man. <laughs> Trying to fight him in that little space ain't gonna work. This is the most trouble I had with these guys since my first playthrough. <laughs> like I said, this character ain't like my other one. Mages are known to be more squishy, so it makes sense. Especially since I'm not. This weapon isn't like. It doesn't have good stagger damage, it's just a regular straight sword. And the sleep resistance. I might switch back to another weapon. I don't know. It could be good later on. The certain enemies, the internal slip is just wonderful against the certain enemies where it doesn't work at all. So. I just need to be smart about about what spells I'm using and what area I'm in. I'm about 
for that because I'm in a tight space again. Why do you have such a long combo? And the range, man, is ridiculous. Can't even roll out of the range. Trying to fight him in these little bookshelf area. I'm so glad this fell so quick because <laughs> it can clear a room. just to get my runs back. Okay. Excuse me. I need to go back up. Struggling. <laughs> it's fun though. It like it does, it's not irritating me. It's just, it's just kind of crazy. I think I need four now, right? No, I'm still good. I don't know if that's enough. I didn't really look. That's nose red. Yeah, that's not enough. And do I want to change back to one of these? It's 15 decks. No, I think I am going to switch to carrying source sword. I mean, this build focus more on my magic than using that weapon. It's not. I don't got enough blessings in this area to be that strong. I know I'm kind of under level for the blessing it part of this. But like I said, usually I'm like blessing level 15 when I did that uh, shadow key. Nah. So let's go ahead and use this up. Dang, have I not found the S war yet? I ain't gonna better do it yet. I gotta actually find the person shield S war. To be able to change it. That's all good. And I wonder. Oh, I don't have it on this character yet. I don't know where it is. Um, the magic shield one. I probably haven't found it. Probably is one of. <laughs> I know I haven't found everything on this character. I just did most of the bosses and everything. I did all the bosses and stuff. Uh, the magic shield um, spell. That's what I was talking about. Okay, what level is this? Nineteen. Wrong. That way I can enhance my shield. I guess I could create some grease for it. Shield grease. I don't know if I have it that cookbook either. I don't. <laughs> no, no, I'm thinking about it. It'll be alright though. Seventeen strength, fifteen, thirteen decks. This is with ninety-four physical, seventy-four car boosts. 
This party in his 76 bar boost. Yo. No point really to take it to 25, but. Well, actually, yeah, because this weapon can attack with it, so it makes sense. You get more physical and magic. How many do I have? I know I still got these four. I'll have five after this, because I still got the one from the Shadow Realm. Um, I think I'm gonna take this to 60. Just because of how it's doing. Maybe at 40. And it's at 30. Let's see. Strength is. I think it's 17. It's 15. We'll find out in a second. 72. Seventeen strength, fifteen, thirteen. Yeah. Hard thou. Now. It's the left hand armament that I need to look at too. I'm looking at the wrong one. Forty. Two. I don't know why I still feel like I looked at that wrong, bro. <laughs> yeah, I looked at it wrong. <laughs> it's been one of them days today. 17 strength. I don't know why I keep trying to do 17 decks. It's only 13 decks. I don't actually need to... Oh yeah, I did. Change my decks. 17 strength. Okay, so I am going to take the picking. Still gonna need that. It's 13 dexterity, right? Oh, I just need to get one more point to be able to use that spell again. Okay. 500 now it's C and C skill okay so now I'm um, same thing I'm start raising the decks and I'll be able to get some off of there since so C and C and D I gotta find that ash of war though Strike. So that way I can make this code. 75. Not bad. Yeah, it's the strongest I got so far. Yeah, I focus more on magic. If you want to get that back. Stamina, I gotta pay attention to that. They, I forgot they did nerf these shields to where they used less stamina than was intended. So, I still was not paying attention to that. Sorry. I wonder. I'll have to, you know, two handed to be able to do the critical hit though because I'm using a stab <laughs> did 
definitely use way more stamina now. Still a good weapon though. Okay. Should definitely use this now. Okay. So I still need a nuke. Just based on how much health these guys got. Let's take that off from this off. I'm gonna need a nuke. So let's try this one. Not nah, well bring common back out. It's just how much like health they have. Like this is good, but without the stuff to boost it. I need something that demolishes their health pretty fast. If you know what I mean. That's the only problem. It seems like they nerfed the shield strike as well because it usually blocks when you attack, but it doesn't seem like it's blocking as good as it used to. Or maybe do I have to have to ask for war to get the best of it? Because it doesn't seem like it was working there. Yeah, let's try the ton. Hold on, I need to see something. So I'm in the twos now. See if it works better when I'm too in it. Yeah, it's blocking now. Yeah, it seems like they changed it to where when you one hand in it, it doesn't work as well. It's usually when you one hand it, it still blocks when you're doing this attack. But when you're two-handed, it still works as well. Okay. So I'm going to have to remember that. Definitely still good at breaking people's stagger, though. I need to take Knight coming off. Thumb is just going to be better. Done with my testing. I'm trying to trying to figure out what's the best method of using it. I'm on. Let's 
That's what it seems like. If I'm fighting them, I might want to just two-handed and fight them. Or just shoot them with Comet from far away, because... It'll definitely get the job done. Three shots, yeah. Definitely need a nuke, so... And so I can get the fingerprint staff and the, and the chest piece from your mirror. To, we'll see if the fingerprint will be the nuke. That's the goal. All the way down. It takes me to Mesmer, right? Yeah, it takes me to Mesmer. I don't want to do that again. Needs to go to the floor I haven't been on. See, I don't have the cat ring. I think this was really messing me up. So I need to get onto this floor below me. I need to get to the fourth floor. I can't remember how to do it. I just did this dungeon. That's the craziest thing about it. Maybe I do need to move it back. I actually think I'm gonna swap these too. So I can still do my spells in this hand. That makes it easier. A lot easier. Can I not? Hmm. See, that's the biggest problem. I don't have a cat ring. I wonder, do I have a spell that allows you to... Drop. I think I can figure it out though. I think it's because the fact that I just did it is driving me cuckoo. Making me confused, not driving me cuckoo. down from here, that's what I'm saying. Because I never came through here. <laughs> that's why I said I'm just confusing myself. Increases your equipment load, HP, and stamina, all right? I'm 
I'm like, yeah, I really was just throwing myself out. I think I can actually take this way to go down, right? I don't have to... I don't drop down from here. Because I've already been to this section. That's the section I need to go. I think I can just take this way. I think Shield Strike is in this dungeon too, so they'll be able to check. Is this just a secret right? Okay, so it was just a secret room. No, there's one right in here. I think Commander Gaius is this way. And this is another spell, right? It's not this drop, but the Thorn spell should be pretty close to here. Okay, let's get up right here. Let me get the side of burst out before I try to jump off. I just remember Commander Guys is on the lift at the, one of these edges. It's actually pretty easy to get to Mesmer. When you think about it, once you hit that switch, you can go straight to him. This is the fourth floor, right? This is like two of them. So it's not this one. It wasn't this one, right? This is the one that goes all the way up. Right. Takes me to the loft. No, I guess I haven't reached there yet. Probably need to come down the other way. And then... We just gonna take some more health. <laughs> Thank you. 
trying to remember, do I usually jump down to this one? I made that jump too. As soon as I realized where I was at. <laughs> this is the episode I died the most on literally since my very first playthrough. I haven't died this much in a while. I didn't even die this much um, in New Game Plus the whole run so far. And I'm not blaming my character for it. I'm just, I'm having an off day. <laughs> Please don't come here and kill me. No, man, don't do that. I see it coming, like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> he was just gonna come and shoot me right after my animation ended and I was just gonna die. Man, that takes forever to get off. Yeah, that's a long running. Okay, so it charges like that. 18. And the running one. Come on. That takes way too long to get off. It's not worth it. Are you serious? That's just me being stupid right there. Okay, so I've already been down here. I just didn't come all the way down. So, that's not gonna help me. I will go grab these rooms, but yeah, I've already been down here. I just didn't come across the bridge. How do I get back to the loft? It's the only thing that's really confusing me. That I'm not remembering. Because that's what I need to take. Let's just go straight to here. I don't. Maybe I can't get back there by going the way from Mesmer. Yeah, when I said today has not been my day, this is the funniest episode 
in a long time. All oh, these falling to these stupid deaths, man. This is funny though. It's not irritating. It's just funny. <laughs> so, I don't know what. Uh, I haven't died this much in so long. I think I might have died more times in this episode than I died versus the final boss. I kid you not. <laughs> That's how it be though, it be them days. Kinda forgot I should have I shouldn't have uh, put that point in health. I should have put that point um To my intelligence, so I can get the spell back. I mean, into faith. It's right here, right? But let me get the side of grace. This take no, that's the room right above. Probably right, gonna pause the video so I can remember how to get over to the loft. Because I don't know why I'm forgetting how. It's something so obvious that I'm just missing too. I think it's just fatigue because I didn't do this dungeon. <laughs> this is my third time doing it. But I just did it recently on my other playthrough. Uh, even though I'm doing locations differently, I did do this. Uh, I did this yesterday because I played my other character all day yesterday, and now I'm playing this one all day today. So I did end up doing this. I think it's one of my last videos was the Black Heap. So I'm just throwing myself off. That's all it is. Can I use this on the shield? <laughs> I can use both of these on this shield. That's pretty nice. This will give me split damage though. Landmark carrying shield. a pretty disgusting shield. <laughs> Literally, it's a pretty disgusting shield, but I don't think I would use that Ash War. I probably would use this one. Yeah, that's a pretty disgusting shield. <laughs> Uh, that's pretty dope. I'm not gonna hold you. That is pretty dope. Okay. Let's drop down and get that spill. Pretty cool looking shield like that. To do that. Following the dose like an idiot. I'm like, yeah, I just hopped down. <laughs>
This is a hilarious episode, man. If again I did drop down once. I don't know why I'm having trouble remembering where to go. Okay. So when I first came here. This is the first floor, right? So we climb this all the way. It's a very long ladder took us to the top. It has to be from here. I just must have went a different way when I came up here. That's all it is. It's, it's just dungeon fatigue. <laughs> it's not game fatigue. I'm still enjoying myself. I'm not hurting myself out. <laughs> First thing we did was knock him off. No, I forgot I had that Ash War. That's why I used to abuse them before. You can give me your helm. Yeah. Gotta be from here. There's an enemy behind us. We're gonna ignore him. Yeah, here. I don't know why I forgot I didn't come through here last time I went through the other way. Like I said, <laughs> this fatigue. Shadow keep messing me up. All these falls to my death and stuff like that. It's hilarious though. Yeah, boom. There we go. Solves that pretty easily. Reach. 
So is it part of it? I wonder, did I have Wave of Darkness on this shield? I need to check to see if I can get Wave of Darkness on this shield. It might be a spell to use. I mean, a Thrusting Sword, I mean... The Flame Skewer is very good for breaking enemy voice. But since I'm trying to focus on magic, I'm like, might want to get rid of the, <laughs> the fire on here. that are flying like that. Blintstone's good, it's just... Comet is very good for keeping up with people. Yeah, I couldn't block it at the last minute. for fire defense compared to these. But it makes sense since she used it fire and magic Alana. So it makes sense. So I already got the item that was over there. Remember the goal of up here? Is that the no no drop down over there? That's good. Cool. I know I'm not going to go back yet because I haven't reached the thing yet. I'm 
Okay, it's not gonna look good. This will take more I need to. This was taken to the point and I got this right. Yeah. The whole point of this episode. <laughs> well, I was going to knock out the shark keep anyway, so. Probably fight him in this one and then we'll start Mesmer next episode. Or I might just go ahead and knock out Mesmer too since we're already done it. As I can do it within three hours, it'll be good for me. But don't try to go over three hours. And depending on the game, I might make it one hour. It just depends on what I'm like doing. And I gotta go here anyway next. This is gonna be finished the rest of the majority of my magic. I go in this way. And I believe it, yeah, I did get it. In Bonnie Village, I think I picked it up. I don't know if it'll work. He's gonna be super far away for the other one. Jesus. How did that comment miss? I didn't think he was that far away. What? Did you see that it went right through me? Alright, something is bugged. Like, his hitbox is really bugged. I don't get how he can hit me always. And then I'm hitting him, but my shots ain't hitting him. You know what I mean? Attack right there. I'm sitting here pressing the dodge, but I'm not pressing the attack. I don't know what that was. I know it was dead as soon as he hit him. I'm like, what are you doing? I'm not inputting <laughs> attack, but I'm inputting the dodge button. Come on now. The last time I input the, when I did the uh, the guard counter, so I'm like, what are you doing? I ain't doing that no more.
Yeah, but I don't know why. The, the thumb is straight up missed. Explain to me how it hit me right there. Come on, man. Open the weapon over. Mess this up. How did he change who he's gonna hit mid-air? Please explain that to me. Like, explain it to me how that works. Thank you. I'm dead. It's all good though. I, I got it. I couldn't put on the uh, golden scare. But explain to me how he can change who he's gonna hit mid-air. He turned around in the air and hit me instead of hitting the mid. They really need to fix his uh, hitboxes because half of my shots were missing too as well. Didn't make sense, like, at all. Let me go get these Scattered Blessings. My bad, Shadow Blessings is what they call it. It's a Shadow Tree. Since I know how to pronounce it, I might as well say it the right way. Stop saying Scattered.
I really wish they gave us a like made the up and air bow that good because it's not, but because <laughs> that would be disgusting. But I know that's why they don't give it to us like that. That would just be too easy to mail bosses because they do way more damage than you can. I mean, even with the new talismans and stuff, it's not that strong. Don't get me wrong, you can make a strong bow build, but you have to use the new bows in the game. I just kind of feel like that's kind of cheap that uh, they can attack us that strong. I understand we may not need to be as strong as them, but the, the Ash of War for it, I think it's an enhanced shot or enchanted shot, it's just not that as good. I mean, it may be better now uh, with the new talismans, I haven't tried it out, but... Not enough for me to be like, <laughs> this is the best build ever. Cause especially uh, the boat that you can get from doing Onsbeck's quest or killing Onsbeck is way, it's disgusting. The eight shots. I guess I could do frost weapon. Giant Hunt's pretty disgusting too as well though. Good job messing around with these necks. Time, but they seem like they might, you know, be pretty strong later. Oh. Anyone in the face? Now we use that spell. Get these off. I'm about to be able to get the rest of the fingerprint spells and stuff, so. We are going to need to do this. That back on. Maybe I would. I'm trying to replace it anyway with your mirror stuff, so it's not really gonna matter too much. Keep coming on for now. No, no, no. We won't worry about coming for now. We'll keep that one on. No, mm -hmm. um, yeah, we'll keep coming on for now. Put that back. We we'll have to try out this gravity spell. Let's go ahead and see if we can kill Mesmer. If I can't kill him quickly, then we'll fight him next episode. Um, part of me kind of wants to do... No, I'm not really worried about the talismans and stuff in this character. I already said that, so... Let's we'll just go ahead and do this.
mongrel intruder. That tarnished, it seemeth. Mother, wouldst thou truly lordship sanction in one so bereft of life? Yet, my purpose standeth unchanged. Those stripped of the grace of gold. Shall I think they edited this fight death. too because during the second phase, music plays while he's doing his dialogue too. But when I watched some other people's they gameplay, there was no music playing. So I think it's the review copy people. Uh, I think they played it before they edited it in there. But um, yeah, so I was watching people's gameplay and I was like, hold on, doing the second phase, music cuts in when he's doing the dialogue. It makes it so much cooler. I guess uh, when they did the review copy, they didn't think about that. And they passed it and added it to it. That's what I'm thinking. Fell off. <laughs> Let's see this spell. Okay. That's a slow charge. How about if you just do it regularly? That was all pretty fast. But if you charge it, it goes twice. Disgusting damage. Every gravity spell does disgusting disgusting damage. Plus having giant hunt on there. I will not suffer. A lord devoid of light. No mother. Forgive me. But you'll see, when he talks about the abyssal serpent, the music usually cuts in. But on some people's videos it doesn't, so I figured it must be the people who got the review copy, so they played it before the game had went through. It's been through three patches since Shadow of the Earth Tree, so. Way more epic with the orchestra behind it.
flying around when I die. <laughs> Stop running around. A curse upon thee. Yeah, but that gravity still is pretty good, especially if you can get the charge off. It does a lot of damage. Now he's gonna try to kill me. Was I heavy load this whole battle and didn't even notice it? That is crazy and I still was dodging. Was I wearing a different helmet? No, I was wearing this helmet. I don't know. Oh no, I think it's because of this. Yeah, that's what it is. The golden scarab is heavier. I was like, there's no way I was heavy this whole time and didn't notice. Yeah. Alright, we're going to end this video. It's at three hours. <laughs> I love you guys, and I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for the love and support. Shout out to Earth Tree as we're playing the Mage playthrough, and I'm gonna see you guys later.